That means that the lift is now working. Yes, there we go. So let's go to the second floor, since we've already been on the first, that in the basement. The second floor seems like the logical conclusion to take. Can't go through there. And there's nowhere else to go, apparently, so... Yeah, second floor is, uh, is not where we want to be right now. Third floor, then. Let's hope we have more luck on the third floor. Or not. The lock is, uh... Apparently jammed. Uh oh. <gasps> it's the fourth floor that's not on the map and has appeared out of nowhere. And just as a little bit of a backstory, in Japan, where this game was made, they don't have fourth floors in hospitals because the word for four in Japanese um, sounds like the word for death in Japanese. Um, so I suppose that's a bit, uh, a bit weird, but anyway. But yeah, I believe the, um, letter four, uh, letter four, the letter four, yeah, that's because what's that, the letter four. I believe the number four is something like she, which, uh, it sounds like, or is the word for death, I can't even remember. And as such, hospitals don't have a fourth floor because they consider it unlucky to have a floor basically called death. I can understand that. Kind of like in Western culture, you sometimes see buildings without a 13th floor. It's uh, not uncommon. So yeah. That's a little sort of story behind why the fourth floor is quite creepy, especially given the fact that it's part of the hell world, as you can clearly see. And it also appears out of nowhere, and it's not on any of the maps. That kind of just really adds to the uh, mystery of it. But anyway, we're now back down the third floor. And obviously, since we're in a hospital, we do have some some nurses as enemies, some demonic nurses. So we'll have to avoid them as we look around. And there's a bird cage here. It's empty. Okay, that's uh, probably a puzzle. Uh, do anything in this laundry room by the looks of it? Oh, where am I now? And where's that enemy that I can hear? Is that them? There they are, right. Oh, you're fast, aren't you? Right, now that they're dead, uh, let's go on to exploring this room a bit. Can we get through to where the lift is? Well, we've unlocked it now, that's good. That's locked. This one's open now. Uh, this appears to just be a like patient's room. Although there's this on the wall. A plate of cat. Obviously, again, another, some sort of puzzle piece. That lock's jammed. Where haven't we been in this room, then? The door on my left and the door straight in front of me. This one's open. Uh, is there anything in here? Seems to be some sort of supplies room. Can't walk past the IV. Oh, is that some bullets? 
Not sure why you'd have bullets in a hospital. Uh, this bottle filled with some sort of liquid, apparently. Ah. Can I pick this blood bag up? Yeah, blood pack. There we go. Can I go through here? No, I can't. So, um, as for doors that I haven't opened, I think it's only this one. Right, so I've got two rooms on my left, with the toilets, and then there's a few rooms further along the corridor that I've yet to check. That's locked. This one's open, though. Anything useful in here? There's a lot of blood on the floor. And there's another plate. It's a plate of turtle, this time. What was that? Was there something that actually happened in the room then, or was that just a scare the shit out of you moment? Because it kind of slightly worked. I certainly wasn't expecting it. Anyway. So I skipped the first two doors, and then I've got three doors along here that I haven't checked, which are room 302, 303, and 304, I think it said. Well, this is a save room. And there's a VCR. VCR! Used to play VHS cassettes. God. I remember them when they were relevant. Now it's all Blu rays and digital downloads. Anyway, I'll save there. And uh, keep looking around this floor. That one's jammed. And this one's open. So what's in here? An enemy, apparently. Ah, oh, there you are. Oh god. Right, okay. The ones dressed in green seem to be faster than the ones dressed in blue. I wonder if that's actually, uh... Right, there's some sort of steel plate screwed to the wall. Presumably, a screwdriver is going to solve that uh, puzzle. We're going to unscrew the steel plate and find something behind it that's useful. Anyway, let's go round to where the lift is and see if we can go down to the second floor. So this is the lift, I believe, through here. Yes, here we are. And I do go down to the second floor now and explore there. And the fourth floor's disappeared off the map. Off the map. Off the lift now. I can't go back up there. That acted only as like a portal through to the hell world. Right, that's locked. So I still can't go through there. Although there were some stairs. So I wonder if I can take them to get to the rest of the second floor. Let's go back up to the third floor because I think I was meant to take the stairs down. Thinking about it rather than the lift. But anyway... Let's go and check out those stairs, wherever they are. I think it's the door straight ahead of me now. No, I've walked into completely the wrong room. Where do I want to go? Right. This door, and then it's the door straight ahead of me. Marvellous. Right, so down here. This takes us to the second floor. Can we get in? We can. We can explore the second floor. Kill you. There is another one. Because I can hear it. Hair. Whatever. Oh, there you are. Well, you're dead now, aren't you? Right. Time to explore this area, too. 
so. No, no. Oh, right, I've gone back into the stairway. Damn it. Right, let's check these doors. Oh, hello. I'm certainly better at combating the nurses than I was at those uh, weird child demon things in the uh, school. Lighter. Presumably that means I have to burn something. Okay. That's locked. That's also locked. This one's however open. It's got a nurse in somewhere. Oh god, no, it hasn't. It's got horrible tentacle monster. Yeah, shooting that doesn't work. Does it? Um, lighter, I suppose I could try. I don't think that's how you do it, but... Ah, no, I think actually... Yeah, you use the blood pack and it focuses on that for a bit. You chuck it over there and it'll go, oh! Let's have some of this lovely blood, and then you take the opportunity to just go, Oh! Give me that plate of Hatter. And then you leave. Alice in Wonderland references there, presumably. Cat, Hatter and Turtle. I'm not sure where the Turtle fits in, but... Cat and Hatter, surely. The Cheshire Cat and the Mad Hatter, of course. I don't know enough about Alice in Wonderland to uh, be able to determine what the turtle represents, but anyway. Is there anything in here other than just a passage? Ah, right. Where's my notebook? Right, let's quickly note this down. Right. Clouds flowing over a hill. Clouds over hill. Sky on a sunny day. Tangerines that are bitter. I presume this reference is colours. So, it's probably white or grey. White or grey first, and then uh, blue, because it's a sunny sky. And then tangerines, obviously orange colours. Lucky four leaf clover. And that's going to represent green, isn't it? Presumably, I've got plates that are going to be in that colour, I assume. These cat plates. And the Hatter place. So yeah, presumably I'm going to have a white one or a grey one. I'm not sure yet. Uh, a blue one, an orange one, a green one and a purple one. And this possibly denotes the order. Ah, and dandelions. That means a yellow one as well. So that means six of them. Unavoidable sleeping time. I'm not sure what that means. Ah, that's... Um, Maybe the sleeping time is black, possibly. And, uh, yeah, liquid flowing from a slashed wrist. Uh, that's going to be blood, isn't it? So, yeah, so that's red. So, white or grey, then blue, then orange, then green, then purple, then yellow, then possibly black, then red. Uh, yeah, if there's... There's eight... Numbers then, possibly. There are four square indentations on the door. I, yeah, I, I don't know then. Can I just use these, or do I have to actually put them in a... Ah, right. Some of them are already in there. The white, red, purple, and black are already in there. So I get it. So it's white is first. And then it's the sky is blue next. So... It's not that one. The, the tangerines are orange, and then the four-leaf clover is green, so the green one goes there. At least I think that was green. Yeah, it looks a lot more green now. That, yeah, that one's definitely the blue one, so there we go. So that one goes between the white and the orange, apparently. Then we've got one more, have we? Yeah, we've got the yellow one, the cat. So that goes between the purple and black. So now we've just got to find the red one. That's going to be the last uh, plate. Uh, thinking about Alice in Wonderland. Possibly Queen of Hearts. So Queen plate, I don't know. Anyway. 
Let's go through this door here. That's locked. Oh, what's this? Ah, oh, right, yeah, these numbers. These mean things, don't they? Right, so we've got 35 Lydia Finley. 60 Trevor F. White. 18 is Albert Lord. 50, yeah, not 15. 45 is Roberta. Roberta. Roberta T. Morgan. And then finally, we've got 38 is Edward C. Briggs. There's a note to them. Okay, that was the Grim Reapers list, apparently. Um, well, down to the first floor, then. The only thing I can see now is uh, what we do. And I suppose we've got the basement as well, possibly, to check out. Where are you? Nurse, not down here. Where are you? There you are. Oh, you're not a nurse, you're a doctor. You're dead doctor now, aren't you? That was a really... That, that made me really uncomfortable, that... That groan they made as he died then. Let's go through this door. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Right. Die. Oh, I really don't like the groan they make when they die. Oh, where are we? Oh god, get away, get away! Oh, that is really horrible. How much ammo have I actually got left? Oh, got 83. <laughs> Not doing too bad then, actually. Uh, is there anything useful in here? There's another door. But that's locked, apparently. Sound is heard from beyond the door. Aha, uh -huh, I think I know what might be beyond that door. I have to find a way to get in there, though. Oh, God. Where's that coming from? Down there. Right. That's a horrible groan. What doors have we got on here? We've got... Let's start with this one. Is there anything in here? This is the director's office, isn't it? This is where we picked up the stuff off the floor in the actual hospital. That was a really weird noise. Um, there's our final plate as well. The plate of Queen. I was correct. It was the Queen of Hearts, which represents the... Uh, <coughs> that represents the red plate. No idea what the turtle is, though. It's... Never been a massive fan of like Alice in Wonderland. I've only ever seen the Disney one, and by the Disney one, I mean the animated one, not the uh, more recent one with Johnny Depp in. Didn't see that one. Oh God, why did that beep as I went in? Ah, that's the basement. Let's not go down there just yet, then. Let's clear out this floor first. Where's this enemy? Oh god, there you are. Oh. How did that not hit me? Not that I'm, like, disappointed that it didn't hit me. Just questioning it. Pick up that health drink, though. Anything else useful in here? No, it doesn't seem to be. Right, then. That was... Quite literally, the kitchen from hell. Um, I suppose Hell's Kitchen probably was a bit of a better thing to say. Anyway. Uh, bullet